The chart section of weatherlink.com is your blank canvas to visualize all of your data. Each gateway has its own chart view. You can access your installed gateways or gateways that have been shared with you via the drop-down with the gateway you are viewing at the top of the display area. To start, select the start date and choose a time span. You can view an hour of data or a full year. We'll leave it on a week of data for this demonstration. Now access all of your data on the sidebar. On this gateway, we have a weather station and three nodes installed on different irrigation blocks. Select data that you are interested in. For now, I will pick the 4-inch soil moisture measurement on the Centic 12-ring drill and drop sensor on each of the three irrigation blocks to compare. As you can see, the standard colors are set to the default for the 4-inch soil moisture ring, but we have several ways to differentiate the data. To start, you can always roll over the data on the chart to display where the data is coming from and get a snapshot at that moment in the timeline. You can also click on the legend to change the line color. Let's change the first two colors now. Lastly, you can roll over a chart legend item to see the gateway, node, and port number that the data is coming from. If you want to add more data, you can select it from the sidebar. Let's add temperature and humidity. Since soil moisture, temperature, and humidity are all on different unit scales, you can move the y-axis to the left and right of the chart by accessing the icon in the top right of the chart. Let's move temperature and humidity to the right of the chart and select apply changes. If you want to zoom into a specific area of the map, simply select the area by clicking and dragging across it to zoom into the data. That is a quick overview of the chart section of weatherlink.com. Enjoy exploring your data.